Good morning. So today we're gonna do some curbside pickups, run a few errands, do a photo shoot for some cookies. Vlogmas number 13. trying to get some coffee because <laughs> yesterday we didn't get any coffee at all like we planned on it we just ended up doing a bunch of other stuff instead of getting coffee so we're finally here at Dunkin I don't think we're gonna be getting a dozen donuts this time maybe just some donuts for the kids maybe I'll get one I'll see how it looks okay let's look at the menu because the menu is poorly placed donut menu is right there and then you have to memorize what you want in order to order over there because there is no donut menu all the way over there. A coconut latte, frozen coffee, uh, caramel. Can we get the munchkin 10 count? That line wasn't that bad. It's just stressful because of that space. This, this line, the line went like zigzag. At one point, it, like it goes straight and then like two, like two sides. There was like three entryways into it. So we had three different cars come in at us and behind us. And on top of us, <laughs> below us. So it wasn't that bad. I figured like it was gonna go by pretty quickly because it's just coffee and donuts pretty much. So we got, just got done with the drive through. It wasn't that bad. Just ordered some coffee and some little munchkin donuts. They're like donut holes for the kids. I think Jay got the same one he got last time. I got like um, coconut latte. It's okay. Bad, but this one's better. Your frozen coffee thing is good. So now we're heading to Michael's. We're gonna do a curbside pickup. Hopefully, they don't shut it down again it's before six, that's for sure. Hey, Michael's in Chino. This is Southern. How can I help you? Hi, I'm here for a curbside pickup. Oh and what are you Number four. Thank you. You too. Yes. So finally got my order. I think I ordered this like five days ago. <laughs> Walmart, right. the tips over we're there the Target, and the cats. Target run. Probably gonna do a Target haul because we're gonna be here for six hours again. <laughs> we're only gonna be here for we'll an hour. We go. We're only gonna be here for two hours. How much money we spent. We're gonna only be here for five hours. Oh. Why is it going up? There it is. Target. No, no, no. No. Where are we guys? Target. Whose favorite photo is this? Mama, Mama and me. There it is. We're in Target now. Kids' favorite bottles for milk. Oh, here! Isn't it? They're here! Right in front. You pick one for your brother. We're shopping for Ryan's okay. World Squishies. JJ's favorite. So what these are are just pretty much mystery bags. Blind they bag. open it. Oh, blind bags. Yeah, the blind bag. Here are the characters that it comes with. Um, potentially come with. Uh, they open it and they figure out which one is it. Yeah, JJ is a big fan of Ryan. One of the reasons why he likes to talk to the camera. I think I can get a superhero. Okay, hopefully. Roscoe's dog food. This is what we feed Roscoe every day. Oh my gosh, where are we? Games, I guess. Oh, I tried looking for a pop socket. Usually, the pop sockets they have them on sale, but I can't find any. Just hanging out at Target. Woo. What you doing? Hanging out. So we just got done with Target. Did you have fun in Target? Yeah. I think we spent like five hours here. Spent like six thousand dollars. Just kidding. No, we actually we we're pretty fast today, so it wasn't too bad, right? Did you got what he wanted? I got absolutely nothing. As per usual, what do you think you're gonna get? Uh, Superman. Superman squishy. Okay, we'll see. We just got done with Target. What did you get? Squishy. For being what? Good. I'm gonna load up the car. Pop is gonna load up the kids. I got my pickup, curbside pickup, but since we ended up going inside, I just picked it up. Wait. We just got 
something at Target. How long did we stay there? <laughs> when we get home, we'll just do a quick Target haul. So right now we are at one of our favorite ramen spots. Oh my gosh, they have the soup. Their broth is so good. So we were able to order um, pick up because they're closing in about 10 minutes. So luckily we were at the Target down the street from here and I was like maybe we can order it before it closes So by the time we get here we can pick it up because we were like literally five minutes down the street So luckily they took our order and Jay's just gonna go pick it up right now So we ordered three soups two cut rolls and then one hand roll This is pretty much like our typical order and the kids love the noodles and the soup here You guys love the soup and the noodles, huh? Yeah! It's your favorite, huh? Yeah. Are you guys ready to go home, take a rest, and eat some soup? They were behaving pretty well at Target, so we got them a Ryan squishy toy, and it's like a blind bag thing. I think Jay talked about it earlier, so we're going to open that at home too, and we'll do a quick Target haul of what we ended up getting, which was like a bunch of random things. But I found these really cute containers. Can't wait to show you guys. Finally picked up my Michael's order. Like I said earlier, we were able to go to Target. It's Pretty busy day today. I'm gonna go home, probably change, take a nap, and kind of see what else to do from there. No, we're done. Empty. I'm gonna, I don't know what I'm gonna get. Hold on, wait for your brother. Casey, you gonna open his? Roquan is a place we went to. We got some sushi and ramen. It's like one of Hold our up. favorite sushi and ramen places. Very nice. So that's what Jay got. Jay got the black miso spicy soup. And then we got two orders of the tonkatsu ramen, which is like the, I think it's like the original one. So we got the kids their own. And then I got another one. And then he got some. Oh, yeah. Hey guys, so we're back from Target. We had some lunch. I just wanted to do a quick haul. We got some stuff from Target and I did my curbside pickup at Michael's finally. It only took me like three days. But I'll show you guys what we got really quick. I'll just start with Michael's because that's pretty sure it's like four things. So Michael's. So first off, I got these piping tips. I got a number four and a number five. I'm trying to get more into sugar cookies. Like I want to learn how to decorate them. Uh, so I got some piping tips to help me do some decorating. By the way, all these things are Michael's were on sale. I usually only get things from Michael's when it's on sale or I have a coupon. So then I got this cookie cutter. It's like a star shaped snowflake cookie cutter. This was like a dollar. I think these piping tips were like a dollar too. And then I got this cute heart shaped cookie cutter. I thought like when Valentine's Day comes, I could use this. And I think this was like 99 cents too. So that's it. That's all we got or that's all I got for Michael. So I'll just get into the Target haul right now. I'm just gonna do it like super quick. So first off, I got these bins. I got two of them. I think they were about $2.99. It's super, super cute. So it has like this like stripe detailing. Even the lid has like the same kind of pattern. And so it's just one of those where you put the lid on and you like lock it into place. And I think the size is six quarts, 40 quarts, six quarts, 40 quart locking lid. And I think they were like six bucks. I, I don't know, I could be wrong. So I wanted to use these for a project that I wanted to do with like downsizing some stuff. And I wanted to use the bins to put some of my stuff in it. This doesn't fit in the bag. Oh, the Target bag. We were walking down the pet aisle and Roscoe needed more food. So this is a food we typically get Roscoe. It's the Caesar Home Delights. And we like it because it's already like in pieces. So we don't have to like chop it up for him to eat. The other ones are like just solid discs and Roscoe likes these. We feed it to him every morning. So morning and night, so breakfast and dinner. And he's right here. Hi Roscoe. This was such a good deal. So I got this scrunchie pack, what it looks like. And then that's what the back looks like. And it comes in a pack of six. <laughs> and I was so excited. I just took that one out and I'm wearing it right now. So that's what it looks like. It's so cute. It's like a little bow. So I thought I could wear it with my like buns. This one was such a good deal. So if you see here, originally it's $10, but it was on sale and it was 50% off. So it was only $5 for a pack of six scrunchies. And I, I already took them out because I used this one, but this one 
feels so soft. What I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna keep some of them and then give the other ones away as Christmas gifts because I don't need six crunchies. <laughs> so I got this. So I got a few like random things for the kids and then I just saw some and I was like, this is too cute. I can't not get it. So for the kids, like Casey, I got him these flashcards. I thought they were super cute. So they're like for alphabet learning. And then I guess they have like animals on them as well. So Casey's still having trouble with his alphabet. JJ learned his alphabet pretty quickly and Casey is still having trouble with some of the letters. He knows most of them. So I hope these flashcards will help. I mean, they were only a dollar, so. I got them these two sticker packs. So one was for JJ and one was for Casey. And they each have 120 stickers each. You just pull them out here and they come out. And this was at the dollar spot and it was only a dollar. So that was cool. It's like 120 stickers for a dollar? Sure, let's throw it in there. I also found stuff from the dollar spot. This was a dollar and it comes with a stamp and an ink pad, which I thought was cute. I wanted to use these when we send out our holiday greeting cards. I'm gonna put them in envelopes and then stamp the envelopes. I found this super cute headband at the dollar spot. And you guys can see there's like a floral detailing and it was only a dollar. So that was cool. I didn't try it on. Oh, oh yeah, it fits, it fits, so we're good. What else do you get for the kids? So they use these bottles to drink their milk in before they go to sleep and before they take a nap. And it just has like two pieces. So it has like the actual cup and then just the lid. But then when you open it up, there's nothing inside. So it's super easy to clean. They drink their milk out of this and only their milk. They drink like juice and water from their 360 cups. But with this, they use it for their milk. So I got two of these because the other ones are already pretty worn down. I think we try to get a replacement every four to six months, depending on how often we're using them. And the ones we have, we've been using them every day. So they get washed every day, at least once or twice or three times a day. The ones that we have over there are pretty worn. So we got some replacement ones and we'll just recycle the other ones or toss them if they're not recyclable. And then some household stuff. She's got some command hooks for the hooks that we have here. We had a lot of hooks, but not enough light. I guess you can call these like refill. Jay got, <laughs> I picked it out for him. He wanted like a sweater, a long sleeve. So I found these. They had the long sleeve with like the waffle material, which was cool. It looked nice, but they didn't have his size. And the only size that they did have, it was white. And I, I don't like anything white because it gets dirty so easily. The kids will get it dirty or get stained in the laundry. So I try not to get anybody anything white. And that was the only color they had in his size. But we found this instead. So it's like a long sleeve for him. It's like a Henley design and it has that three buttons along the top. It's not that bad, it was 14 bucks. So I thought this was nice. He doesn't have enough long sleeves. He mostly just has like t-shirts and tank tops and sweaters, but he doesn't have a lot of long sleeves. So it was nice to get something that he didn't have a lot of. And then the last thing was just diapers. So the kids are potty trained, but they wear diapers. JJ wears his reusable diapers at night and then Casey wears diapers like these kind of diapers at night too because sometimes they all have an accident. But Casey's pretty good at not going to the bathroom at night. JJ goes to the bathroom at night more frequently, but that's the only time they wear diapers. Like during the day, they'll they'll wear their like big boy underwear, but I just got a pack of these. Even then, sometimes Casey doesn't even go to the bathroom at night. He'll go to the bathroom before he goes to sleep and then he'll wake up and go to the bathroom right away and he doesn't even need to go at night. So I have these on hand. These are just the up and up training pants and they just like have the elastic on the side. It's not like a diaper and we just have the kids wear this at night just in case they do have an accident. We don't buy these that often. I think maybe we'll buy these diapers like maybe once a month. And the ones at Target, the Target brand is only like seven bucks. Maybe like once a month we'll buy some, that's it. So that's pretty much it. Just a super quick haul from Target. Nothing too crazy. Just got some random stuff for the kids. Some bins and hair stuff. So if you guys like these type of hauls, let us know. So that way we can film more hauls for you guys and you guys can watch it. Also for Target, if you're doing in-store pickup or drive up pickup, they're giving away these cute little gift boxes. And so this was free. They gifted this to me. One of my orders was for curbside pickup or drive up pickup. There's like a little band here. Inside, it comes with a whole bag of semi-sweet chocolate chips and then some recipe cards. So I thought that was cool. 
I guess they just gift it to you when you do curbside pickup or drive up pickup. So that was nice. So right now we're gonna try to do a photo shoot. We have it set up here. This is kind of how it is when we take photos for my Instagram. And I'll link that below if you guys haven't checked it out already. We're gonna try to do a photo shoot at night, which we've never done before. And we're gonna kind of test out our lighting and the whole setup and we'll see how it goes. JJ is my Mama. little helper. What are you doing, JJ? I'm vacuuming. You're my helper? Yeah. Cool. So we're still trying to get this lighting situated and Jay's trying to figure it out. If it doesn't work, we'll try to shoot again tomorrow, but at least we tried to see how the lighting is tonight. Yeah, I think we're just gonna have dinner, do the kids' advent calendar, and probably call it a night. Tomorrow's Monday, so we have work again. And the kids will be here tomorrow too. <gasps> See you tomorrow, vlogness 14! Yeah. <laughs>